So this is our Fantastic Relay redo event. For those of y'all that remember for our mate event, you know, our standard relay event, we unfortunately were rained out for the first time in 24 years. Um, so the Infinite Energy Arena, they were so gracious enough to offer us their amazing facility. Um, so we're here now to really give our community the event that we did not get to put on back in May. Um, so we have everything that you can ever imagine that goes on in the big event. Um, we've sort of brought it down to two hours to try to still give our community that, that great experience from the reflections to Luminaria to the different celebrations and even as we kick off into our 25th year anniversary which we're super excited about. Um, we have an awesome um, exhibit to where folks can see where we've come from up until now. Um, so we're super excited about this and this is where we're here so we hopefully that the, the community enjoy this and they see that we've tried to capture the essence of what our big relay does in May and these two hours here in October. So I have to say I have only been here for a short time of those 25 years but so many of our awesome volunteers have been here since the beginning and are still here so just the fact that this event every year has grown and grown and grown it is so much fun the survivor celebration is always the best the luminary lap always you know brings us back to what we remember and how we will celebrate those that have fight, are fighting cancer along the way but then we also have so much fun uh, we get to play games and eat yummy food and dance all night long and play bingo and do all those silly things um, that the Gwinnett community has come to realize about what Relay for Life is. We show our death rate dropping uh, from all the research and, and education and everything where we've dropped uh, percentages in the last years. We also see the rising line at the bottom with more birthdays where back in, I, think, I forget what year is, way back in 1973 maybe, we had 3.3 million survivors. And as we go across, we get up to 15 and a half million survivors last year that we had now living five years or longer with cancer, more birthdays. That's why the little birthday things are on there. But the real big reason here in Gwinnett County, how we got here, this little graphic right here, over 8,000 teams in the 24 years, over 20,000 team captains, volunteers, 138,000 participants, 30,000 survivors, 800 plus years of volunteering by over 250 committee, committee members like myself and the others you see around here over these years, 535 years of sponsorship by 132 sponsors, and 115 years of relay support from the ACS staff. That's how we got here. The community put their arms around this in 1994 and have we've maintained this this relationship and that's why we're number one in the world. They would kept talking about Relay for Life having a shelf life and our, our answer to that was as long as there's cancer Relay for Life will be there. It may not be as big as it always was it may you know settle down a little bit but um, because of the generation generational things I think people are different than they were 25 years ago. Life is different, our culture is different but um, as, as long as there's cancer, people, are, people want a way to express themselves. They want to be able to do more than write a check.